finally rid of us. Oh, stop it. We love having you here. Yeah, what were you moving to? Um, Mo's bedroom. Blue. What? <laughs> finally. You're moving in with Mo. I know it's fast. <laughs> Whatever. You guys have been eyeing each other up for like ever. Blue. It's true. You guys are hopeless. You can start packing, thanks. I want lunch. You just ate breakfast. So, these leftovers in the fridge. It's Ruby again. Eat yeah, pack. probably work stuff. What do you need to get there? No. Can't tell me you're going to miss this. Actually, I will. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> I'll miss you. Yeah, you too. <laughs> back at work already. Oh, I have to do something. Otherwise I'll drive everyone mental, myself included. What's wrong? Oh, it's a new, new name tag. Me in black. Oh, sorry. Oh, you don't need to apologise, Leanne. Love is a very precious thing. <laughs> it is, isn't it? And I think some people go through their whole lives searching for that special person. Or they find them and the, and the timing's wrong. They're married or they're gay. <laughs> My first love was gay. <laughs> Benson. <laughs> oh, could I see it? <laughs> it had lovely red locks. <laughs> I don't normally go for gingers. I'm really sorry for your loss, Leanne. Truly. <gasps> you haven't been over in the last few days. I've been busy. Well... I owe you a meal, my girl, and I am not taking no for an answer. And lunch at Caramel with Alice. Christmas plastic chair. Bring it. I need the distraction. From? <gasps> girl troubles. Don't ask. I'm not telling. Oh, see, now you've got me interested. Come on, spill. Tell old Dr. Drew all your troubles. Beautiful day, old dear. Are you wearing makeup? Crap. Oh. How'd the big TV audition go? Audition? Brunch TV. A spot for Dr. Finn. Dawn Waller put me onto it. And they liked me. They really liked me. Great. As long as it doesn't interfere with your workload here. It'll only be a few hours a week. And they're happy to film me live in the PSC. Wow. A celebrity plastic surgeon in our midst. You didn't clear this with me. Chris said he could make it happen. I bet he did. Anyway, I love to stay in chat, but Mrs. Lynn's eyebrows won't lift themselves. Talk about... Ego. <laughs> As opposed to you, the humblest man I've ever met. I just don't want this big TV thing interfering with our output, that's all. Well, I'm sure if Finn wants it badly enough, he'll squeeze it into a heavy schedule. Are you okay? What do you mean? You're not answering my calls. We don't have anything to talk about. I'm, I'm worried about you. There's no need. No, We've moved on. on, Ruby. I know that. Mm. I'm your boss. Nothing else? No. I have to work. Yeah, me too. We're flat out, but I just wanted to make sure you're okay. I'm fine. Just go, please. Ruby looked upset. Yes, she was. She's still crushing on you. Just trying to lay down some boundaries, and it's not easy for her to hear. All right. So there's no reason for me to have this weird feeling I've got, like something's not quite right between us? Nick? We kissed. When? Last week. It was just for a second. When she came around? After that. It was a silly, stupid moment. So you lied. I'm sorry. It didn't mean anything. Vinny? Vinny? Hey, stop. It was an accident. An accident? Well, not an accident, but it was nothing. Okay, so why are you so cut up about it? Because I hate that I've hurt you. So did you kiss her? It doesn't matter. It was a mistake. Like, did and you it's like in the it? past. Look, it was completely out of the blue. I wasn't even thinking. I was stressed with, with mum and with work, and Ruby was just being so kind to well, me. And her sticking a tongue down your throat was, was really lovely of her. See, this is why I, I didn't want to tell you. What, because it had upset me? I'm so sorry. But you don't need to be. Honestly, it was one big mistake. So why didn't you tell me straight away? Okay? There's no point in me being upset if it didn't mean anything. It didn't. You've been so weird for days, cold. I felt guilty. Yeah, and not because you kissed her, it's because you liked it. Babe, it didn't Look, don't, mean... Don't say it didn't mean anything, okay? I'm not stupid. It's not going to happen again, ever. Yeah, but you want it to. I want you. And her. Just you. I love you so much. Please, I don't... I don't want this... What? I don't want to lose you over this. Well, we're not 
breaking up over a stupid kiss, okay? So can we put it behind us? Does anyone else know? No. Well, good. Because it's humiliating enough. What do you mean? How old are you? 24. I remember when I was 24. You just want to have fun, who cares about the consequences? It wasn't like that. So it wasn't fun? It was more than that. For me, at least. So you had the hots for her. It doesn't mean you get to try it on. I didn't plan on it. She's married. She's got a family. Yeah, and she wants you, not me. Nothing else is going to happen. No, it's not, because you're going to stay away from us. That's not necessary. I'm not asking. We all work together. And that's all. You don't get in touch with the outside of work. You don't come to the bar. You don't offer to babysit. She needs friends right now. Yeah, she has them. She's struggling. My wife is none of your business. What's that about? No idea. What did you say to Ruby? Not much. But she looked upset. Good. She's not some evil little homebreaker. She's hurting too. What are you defending her now? I just want us to move on, all of us. Yeah, we can. Are you sure? Yeah. Ruby's staying away from us for good. She said that? Mm-hmm. She knows you made your decision. Good. Do you have to work tonight? Probably. Can we have some time together, alone? I know you probably don't want to spend any no, time. No, not really. I want us back. Yeah? Well, maybe you shouldn't have kissed someone else then. What's wrong, love? Nothing. What's going on, Billy? It's a long story. I've got time. But I don't. Is this about Ruby? Yeah. If there is something going on between you... You just leave it, OK? He told me. About the curse? Is that what you were talking about earlier? We sorted it all out, okay? And you didn't think to include Nicole? She doesn't want to talk to me. Oh, I'm not surprised. She'll be okay. Excuse me? She's over it. Oh, don't make light of my daughter's heartache. I'm not. And Vinny, has, has he even apologised? Mum, what's going on? Well, no wonder you didn't want me poking my nose in. I've been through this, you know. Your father cheated on me for years, and I vowed and declared no child of mine would suffer in silence. No, not in Name public. and shame, I say. Has he even apologised to you? For what? Well, having it off with this little troll. No, stop. I will not. You are a good person, Nicole. No, I'm not. Vinny didn't kiss Ruby. I did. What? Thanks for telling the whole world, Leanne. 